Who is this ghastly man? Your one and only favorite Muppet. <laughs> Cause it's the final countdown! That was annoying. That was annoying. <laughs> Lord knows we pissed some people off with we that. We could do an acapella. Um. No. <clears throat> Absolutely not. Welcome back, Booms. Hey, guys. We're doing IT Crowd today, and of course, it's the final countdown. Oh, that's why we were saying it. Yes. I was just going with it. I didn't know what it was for. <laughs> yes, it's the final countdown, the which is the title of <clears throat> episode two from season four. So that's where we're at. That's what we're going to do. And uh, I don't know. I might do it again. I'm ready. I love doing that with them. Anytime I hear Final Countdown, I really you? think of that song, yes. I like Such a great guitar. song. You like what? Doing the guitar. The guitar? <laughs> yes, it's great. Well, we got some reacting to do. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, like, subscribe, do whatever you guys want. Is she okay? It's like she keeps trying to roll over in her sleep. Oh. Uh-oh. We might, we might have to stop this. <laughs> But uh, let's just go with it for now. All right, here we go, folks. <laughs> that was terrible. Look at my voices today. That was one of our best. That was good. <laughs> oh, he running. Oh, he running. So, uh, how much are you asking for? Oh, nothing. Just take whatever you want. I just don't want to start cluttering up the place with old stuff, you know? That's kind of what this new place is all about. I just want to totally reinvent myself. From this moment on, everything is going to be different. Hello, IT. Have you tried turning it off and on again? I did it! I did it! I've been accepted! No! What's going on? I've been accepted! I applied, and they said yes! Who said yes? What are you talking about? What? What's your shaking? No, oh, well, that was fast. Sorry. Okay, now that that's over Hello. with, three hours later, um, you ready? That was the longest she's ever been awake she was for going one time. Crazy, yeah, crazy. Usually her wake windows are only like two hours right now. Yeah. That last hour though, she was like tired, drunk. Right. Yeah. Just to let you guys know, I got the AC on because it's it's, it's it scorching a hot, hot in today. here. Yeah. So if you are humming in the background, I apologize. But uh, let's continue. Ready? Mm -hmm. All right. Here we go. No! What's going on? I've been accepted. I applied and they said yes. Who said yes? What are you talking about? What? What's your shaking? Constant, please. <laughs> B. And a vowel, please. And lastly, A. And here's the countdown clock. What do you think of this? I have no idea. Nabatitty. Nabatitty? Nabatin. Nabatin. Nabatin? All right, let's see what we've got. Jeremy? Six. And Morris? Nine. <laughs> uh, Jeremy, what's your six? Tenant. And Morris? Um, it actually already is a word. Tenetember. Good heavens, really? Could you uh, use it in a sentence for us? Good morning. That's a nice Tenetember. Someone reminded me earlier, you haven't actually yet got a word less than eight letters long. It's quite extraordinary. You really do look like you're on your way to winning that countdown teapot. <laughs> no offence, Jeremy. <laughs> now, this is, a, uh, this is a show in the UK. Mm -hmm. Which uh, I, I was warned to figure out how the show works yeah. before watching this episode, but I did not. I just didn't have yeah enough time. Um, so sorry about that. But um, I'm guessing you get letters and you have to try to make a word. I think there's more to it than that, but...
fuck. Very persuasive, I think. Well, I don't know how to get in touch with this guy. His stuff is cluttering up my hallway. I have to start putting these up. <laughs> <laughs> Missing person just to get their shit back. <laughs> Mum always says you should never open the door. What do you mean? An unopened door is a happy door, so we never aren't aroused when someone knocks. What, so you all just sit there? Yes. So the doorbell goes, and you all just sit there until the person goes away? <laughs> I yes. do that. What if it's important? What if it's good news? Yes, you do! I do that. I, like, this is a whole generational thing I found out. I come from the generation where if someone knocks on your door and your parents weren't home, your parents were like, you don't answer that door for anyone. So now that I have, like, my yeah, own home, that's I true. still, someone knocks, and I'm like, I make you answer it, and if you're not home, it's not getting answered. What if it's important? They can call me. If they don't you have don't me. answer your phone, though. You're right. If it's I a don't know. but that if it's a number you don't recognize, you don't answer your phone. I do that too, though, because there's so many uh, fucking scam callers mm -hmm. out there that you know, and I'm not a popular person anyway, so. I Usually, remember. if I see it, if I d if I see a number I don't recognize, it's but that's not within like a town within twenty miles of here. Yeah. Um, I don't answer. I remember um, one time we like lived in this house that had a glass door, like it was see through. Yeah. And it had like a design on it, but it was glass. So if someone knocked on the door, you couldn't hide. <laughs> but I'd still hide. I'd still be like, oh, and I'd go like behind. Like the wall or something. I know. I never understood glass doors because if somebody wants to kick that, kick that door down, I'm just fucking. I know. I don't like those either. Yeah. This is London, Jen. It's not someone with cake, unless that cake is made of dog poo and knives. <laughs> Later's. I'm going to zone out the heads of department meeting. I thought you were trying to avoid those. Well, there's only so many times I can say there's a, a ram emergency. Yeah, like RAM on your computer. Oh, I was like, RAM. <laughs> Hello? Yes? Hello, can I come in? Why? What? Why do you want to come in? Isn't this the heads of department meeting every Monday and Friday, or has it changed? No, no, yes, it is, yes. Um, you've missed a few, though, haven't you? Yeah, there was a, a RAM emergency. The um, office had too much RAM. OK, well, you see, the nature of the meetings has changed somewhat, and uh, it wouldn't be fair on you. There'd be a lot of catching up to do. What, did they have, like, orders? OK, thanks, Jen. That's what it se That's seemed what like. That's it seemed it, like, yeah. yeah it the nature like, of the meeting has changed. So. It sounded like women in the background were giggling you and stuff. You can't catch up. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you want to come out? They don't want me. They don't want me at the Monday Friday. I thought you hated those meetings. I did hate those meetings. Until they didn't want me at those meetings. And now I love those meetings. <laughs> Jen loves feeling important. Boss. Thanks, Phil. Oh my god, I hate meetings. I'd be like, alright, thanks. A fan of tiny biscuits. You are full of surprises. 
Please, don't let me stop you. I like a man with appetite. It's what got you this far. Oh my god, is that Wong from the Avengers? <laughs> I think it is. Is it? The, the guy who's like, uh, he's, um, Doctor Strange's, like, assistant? Ca counterpart. Said, yes, I don't know. whatever. I don't know. Sorry, do I know you? They call me Prime. I had another name once. He was a lot lighter back then, I guess. Harold Tong. <laughs> That's right. I won year 16 of Countdown. Yes, it was I who won the 16th Countdown teapot. The teapot we all crave. You crave it too. Your eyes betray you. Uh-huh. <laughs> Why is he, he talking like a Jedi? It's why. You can be made track with that. Do you have the spirit to become an ultimate champion? I wonder. You want to get a photo together or something? I came only to give you this. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> that was definitely Wong. It's gotta be. So somebody let me know if that was Wong from the Avengers. Roy? Jesus, Alistair! Hey! Long time no see. Yeah! Roy and I were at college together. Yeah. Wow. wow you are looking great. Thanks. <laughs> So, uh, what are you up to these days? What I'm up to? Wow, big question. Um, I'm the uh, head writer for Shotgun Games. Do you know that? Yeah! Wow, really? Man, I, I play Shotgun Games all the time. They're brilliant. Oh, thank you. Man, that is so cool. You, hey, you just won an award, right? Yes. <laughs> well, uh, see you soon, Roy. Yes! Don't ask me what I'm doing, you private twat. I was gonna say, you can't even handle that. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not sure I'm in the right place. Oh, you're in the right place, Mr. Moss. Welcome to 8 Plus. <laughs> Fun. Did you notice? Do you notice the crap? It looks like every dude in there is a is a, a full-blown nerd. nerd. Yeah. And every woman in there is pretty. Yeah. <laughs> what is going on? Hey. Listen, ladies, go go for the nerd. You came. I'm glad. That's Roger Black. Is it him? That's Stephen. It definitely is him. It's Wong. He was much lighter back then, though. Maybe, yeah. He's, he's put on some weight since then. I'm calling. You know your ex countdown winners. Why are they all here? Why, for someone who knows how to add and subtract and multiply and divide lots of numbers to get one other number, you're not so good at putting two and two together, are you? <laughs> this is 8 Plus, an exclusive club for those gifted few who make it through to eight episodes of Countdown. And you are our newest member. Oh, isn't that nice? <laughs> Thanks for letting me know, Linda. I All right. love him. All right, bye. He's such a sweet soul. Does it not outrage you, Roy? As a member of this IT department, I, your head, is not being represented at the Monday Friday. Couldn't give a shit. <laughs> My neighbour just called. Turns out that window washing Willy from West Gibberish is not now going to be able to pick up his window cleaning bric-a-brac. Why not? Oh, he was hit by a car or something. It's just my luck. Oh, you shouldn't have agreed to mind it from in the first place. Oh, thanks, Jen. That's really helpful. That's, that's really good advice. That's exactly what I'll do. In the past, when it happens again, last week. I have to give it back to him. It can't just live in my hallway. Don't give a shit. See what I mean? They've always got a. They've always got a. So whenever he's doing something and doesn't have dialogue and yeah. he's traveling somewhere or going to do whatever, whatever. Um, 
They always put some like goofy tune. goofy tune in the background, yeah. That should be my tune when I try to do anything with a baby. Oh. Oh. No, no. Oh, no. 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 Alistair! I'm not a window cleaner! <laughs> I'm not a... Alistair! Alistair! I'm not a window cleaner! <laughs> I'm not a window cleaner! Alistair! Oh god. Why does he want to prove himself so bad to this guy? Dude, what are they doing in this meeting? <laughs> it's definitely. There's definitely some diddling going on oh in that my room. Oh god. You are not it's invited Douglas. to the orgy. You will not be in the orgy. That was the only funny thing from that movie. Really? I thought, I thought the movie was I, fantastic. You know, I, I bet you did. You got to look at naked butt Thor. <laughs> Thor love and thunder. Nah, I, I mean. Who doesn't like Thor? I, I, I mean, I like Thor. He's one of my But that guys. movie sucked. It was, uh, I thought Christian Bale's performance was good, but. Yeah. It's just compared to the other Thor movies, like, I thought it was worse than that second one. The second one was bad, too. First one, meh. I love them. The third one was good. They're just going anyway. in that room. They're wearing dressing gowns. Roy, will you listen to me? I don't have to listen to you. I'm not married to you. <laughs> I've got a lot on my mind right now, Jen. This bloke thinks I'm a window cleaner. Bloke I went to college with, he's doing amazingly the creature he was with. And he thinks that I am a window cleaner. A window cleaner. What's wrong with that? It's a noble profession. If your last profession was cleaning balls... <laughs> <laughs> Google him. I've tried. He has no online presence. Apparently, people were being rude to him, so he suspended all of his accounts. He's not on Friendface. He's not on Jitter. Listen. How do people expect you to track them down if they maintain no online presence? You have both asked and answered that question. What do you think is going on up there? Is this meeting room five? You know, they soundproof that a few weeks ago. Really? What's that all about? Douglas said it was for super secret meetings. But I want to go to super secret meetings. I, I can't believe I might be I missing think you super do, honey. secret meetings. But the dressing gowns, why are they wearing dressing gowns? Orgies. No. Maybe they're getting some kind of executive massage treatment for being brilliant. Do you think they're getting massage? If they're getting massages, I think my human rights are being abused by them not letting me in. Why don't you wear a towel, hang around the door, and see if they let you in? I have my dignity, thank you. No, hang on, that might just work. <laughs> I don't she's, think you want to be in this meeting. Yeah. Especially she's, if Douglas she's is in for a, She's in for a rude awakening. Watch them being something like just really random that we can't even think of. Oh, I can't believe you've joined a swanky club. It's so show busy. Look, oh, Roy, the people here see me in a certain way. It's perhaps not the way I'd be seen outside of the club. I'd just like you not to, you know. I like the door lady. Like you just go upstairs and that's what you see. No problem. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Glass of milk, straight up. Prime. Might be enough for me. Roy? Uh, I'll have a beer. <laughs> Alcohol free beer, surely. No. Get him what he wants. But just get him what he wants. I'll have to go out. Can somebody mind the bar? No, no, no. you know what? It's fine. Um, I'll just. I shouldn't really be drinking during lunch. I'll just have a Coke. Do they don't have alcohol in this club? I guess not. Boo. Will I see you tonight? Or do just the oh, girls no. get to drink, or is that apple juice in her cup? I don't know. What was that? <laughs> Will I see you tonight? Not now, Ivana. <laughs> Do 
Did you have sex with that lady? If you call that mindless, animalistic, rutting sex, then yes. I suppose we did. <laughs> that sounds like sex. Countdown groupies are the most sexually voracious of all groupies. And the most beautiful. I hear someone likes drinking beer. <laughs> this is a private booth, negative one. <laughs> I don't, this is like nerd gangster groups. <laughs> that is the stupidest, most funny insult I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> he called him negative one. Oh, I didn't hear that. <laughs> Play that again. <laughs> but he made it, he made it sound so like, like such a burn. Yeah. Negative one. Here's someone likes drinking beer. <laughs> this is a private booth, negative one. Yeah. <laughs> this is a private club, word. <laughs> word. True that. True that. <laughs> My name is Word here. <laughs> Boy. I'm sorry. I've, I'm sorry, negative word. I heard you've been catching some nice letters. I get the same letters as everyone else. Good when they fall in the right order, though, in it. Steady, gentlemen. <laughs> oh my god. Don't mind him. Negative One was quite proud of being our best speller until Moss came along. Ah, huh. our drinks. This is so weird. Can I just say, I am having a great time. <laughs> hey yo, turn the music off. Turn Only the, the music off. The drink here. Uh oh, what's he up to? Maybe our new champion would like to test his skills out on the street. <laughs> He's challenging you to a game of street countdown. You cannot accept. It's too dangerous. <laughs> well, what do you say? Or is you worried you is going to show yourself up in front of your girlfriend? He's calling Roy your girlfriend. But in the walls of 8 plus, that's a definite diss. <laughs> You're lucky my girlfriend has gone to the toilet. Oh my god. Is she going to answer me or what? No. We promised those days were over. No more unlicensed street countdown battles. <laughs> I didn't ask you. I asked him. Well? When is street countdown? It's more or less the same as normal countdown, except we played on the street. <laughs> I'd fail this game. This show is so wacky. This is a, that, you know, of the sh IT crowd episodes we've watched so far, this one's pretty This out one's there. all over the place, This yeah. one is out there. There's an orgy meeting. There's a secret nerd club. <laughs> They're going to have a street spelling bee, pretty much. And a, and a random window washing guy left his yeah, bike at his ladder in Roy's all house. Over the place. Doesn't sound that dangerous. It can get quite cold. I always wear thermals. Oh, then you're probably fine. Hey, I still stand in here. What do you say, newbie? I came here to drink milk. And kick ass. And I've just finished my milk. <laughs> Why do I feel like that's something you say? Welcome to Street Countdown! Oh, this is so weird. <laughs> First rule of Street Countdown is that you really must try and tell as many people as possible about it. It's a rather fun game, and the more people will tell about it, the better. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get that joke? Did you get that of fight them? I know that joke now because I watched Hello? that movie. That was a great movie. You didn't like uh, it, though. It was weird. It That's, was too weird. It's such a guy movie. It's not even a guy. I like guy movies. It was just... You know what it was? It was the complete opposite of what I expected that movie to be. Okay. I thought it was going to be like... we got, but I thought it was going to be like the An same... An actual, like... Vibe. I thought it was going to be the same vibe as like... 
What's a bro? What's a um? What's it? Super bad. How so? Because it sounded like. Fight Club. What's the first rule about Fight Club? We don't talk about Fight Club. Like, it sounded like it could be, like, a comedy. You thought it was a comedy. I did. Okay. I was fully expecting it right. to be, like, hey, no, man, no. we need to get a club together. What are we going to call it? No. Fight Club. And it's not really about, and even so, it's not about, about fight, fight Club. It's about revolution. Yes. Not, did not think it was going to have this deep meaning. Did not yeah. think it was going to have crazy people in it like not what i thought at all it was yeah. very weird i liked brad pitt hello Moss. it's hard not to you found out <laughs> oh we've all done that Locked yourself on a roof. Oh, oh hey, hey, mate, mate. Um, could you do me a favor? <laughs> so, do you? I know exactly what's gonna happen now. What? He's gonna be rolling down this thing and he's gonna see oh, that guy yep, again and he's right. gonna be like I swear I don't wash windows and then the guy's gonna be like what's wrong with washing windows just do big windows or do you do call outs well do you think I would come around and do your house no <laughs> no <laughs> didn't think that oh my god oh my god oh <laughs> hey what I tell you Alistair <laughs> He thinks I'm a bloody window cleaner. <laughs> Not that there's... It's a noble profession. This guy's gonna either bring him back up or push him out. Is this as fast as this goes? <laughs> Well, high five for predicting that. Not e exactly how it turned we out, but... We both did good. We, the general idea, yeah. Here's I think I get this one. game. What happened to you? Shh. This is the longest word yet on street countdown. Unlike normal countdown, you see. What I happens? don't care. <laughs> Negative one. <laughs> yeah, fuck off! That was the best part. They did the, no the, the noise that the clock does at the end. This is street I only countdown. Needed, I only needed to hear it once to get that. Because that was, they made it very clear the last time in the uh, at the show set I wonder if when they that ever noise came up. Street spelling bees. <laughs> Kids need to watch this, so that's the kind of street games they play. What I don't care. <laughs> One. Mm. Twelve. <laughs> Moss. Sixteen. Do you get how this is played? Not the no number word, part. I do. One. So, they say, like, they have numbers on a board. Like, let's say they have, yeah. like, six numbers on a board. And then they say, like, give me a vowel, give me a continent, give me whatever. And then they put it up. And so they have 18 letters up there. So they can choose, so they have to make a word with not all those letters, whatever number they pick. So negative one picked, what did he pick, 10? Six? I think he picked eight. I think he picked eight. One. <laughs> negative one. Twelve. Twelve. So there's 18 numbers up there. Mm -hmm. So he has to make- A word out of 12 of them? 
he has to make at least a word that's at least 12 letters long out of the 18 that are up there. Okay. And then Moss picked, if I'm wrong, let me know, And then, but it sounds right. And then Moss picked 16, so he has to make a 16-letter word with those numbers up there. Okay. I would not be good at this. Neither would I. 16. <gasps> Your word, negative one. Enormousness. I shall give my answer, if I may, in the form of a joke. This is most irregular. What do you call negative one sitting alone in an empty room? I don't know. What do you call negative one sitting alone in an empty room? Over numerousness. <laughs> Giles? Yes, that is a word, and the joke does make sense. <laughs> I don't think that's a word. Oh, he mad. Good you got God. schooled, son. You, you got, got schooled. You got schooled by Moss. Oh I, think I think you're right, though. That sounds like that's how the game is played. Yeah. Good right job. Too. Thank you. Good job. Without even seeing the actual show. No, I can figure I figured it out. Uh oh, here she goes. Okay, let's go. See? <laughs> oh, it's workout. Oh yes. Yeah. Yeah. Five, six, seven. Ah, Jen, you've joined us. Yes, yes, I have. You're not really dressed for. I thought I'd wear normal clothes and work up a real sweat. Hardcore. And that's me thinking you didn't have it in you. Right, now let's take it to the max. Daniel was going to be either could be an orgy or something weird. So awesome. <laughs> oh my Would god. Would you do a jazzercise like that? Oh, he won the countdown! Countdown Steve winner! Pie. Look at that! Yay. No, I don't like exercising with large groups of people. <laughs> like that would sweat. I just wanted to say, I'm not a window cleaner. <laughs> no, no, I work in IT. Yeah, yeah, with computers and all that. Max, uh, no, I really just work with windows. <laughs> Hello? Oh my god. Oh man. Let's see, no, uh... Yay. No after credit scenes in this season? I guess not. Well, nowhere after credit scenes, eh? Either whoever's posting it got rid of it, or I don't know. Who knows? Good episode, though. That was a really good episode. I liked that it. That was all over the place. It, yeah, it was. It was. It's one of those episodes where everything is just very strange. Yeah. Completely out there. But it worked. You know. It's um. <laughs> they still what never... was your favorite part? I liked, I liked when he poked his head out and was like, why do you want to come in? <laughs> they're like, the atmosphere of the meetings have changed, so you can't come in. <laughs> I just love Douglas. He's funny. He is Douglas funny. Douglas and Moss are my two favorite characters right now. I liked Moss pretending to be a little nerd gangster in the yeah. club. That yeah, was funny. I think that was my favorite part, too. Uh, the negative one, what is his name, though? I thought he was... I don't know what his name is. I thought I he was insulting him in, like, a it, very... No, what's his name? In, in a very nerdy way. Yeah. Finding out was, that was his name was... It made it even funnier for some reason for me. But... Poor Jen had a got a workout in. I know. In her clothes like that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I well, she really little... wanted to get in that meeting. She did. 
I like those little 80s or 70s or whatever. I think it's 80s or 90s workout clothes. There's like a music video. That's like that. It's very uncomfortable. Very sexual, though. Yeah. I don't <laughs> like it. You know the one I... Yeah, you know yeah. exactly what I'm talking about. She's yeah. like thrusting so hard. The girl in it. Well, there's multiple girls in it. And guys. Well, there's one that one skinny guy. Yeah. But he's just there to see all the hot girls work out. And, yeah, but they're in like 80s outfits. Yeah. But he's wearing like tiny little shorts, too. Yeah. And it's yeah. just... They all... All those girls in that music video go to like the best waxer I've ever seen. <laughs> There is not anything. Man, you out are of place. looking. You are <laughs> looking. Are you are looking harder than the guys are in that music video. <laughs> From a girl's point of view, I'm like, I need to know who your waxer is, ma'am. Look a girl up. Ladies, is she right? Because <laughs> we do have some ladies who follow the channel, so. Um, anyway, we hope you enjoyed the reaction, guys. We had a good Thank time you guys. watching that one. Yeah, that so, was good. Like, subscribe, do whatever you guys want, and we'll see you all next time. Bye. Take care, Thank everybody. You. Have a good day today.